you get text messages from them and you've gotten text messages from these women that I, I found some interesting things about. And I wanted to take a look. You know, here's, here's Kelly. Okay, babe. And how many days should I gave to you? Please let me know, because I hardly understand myself here, okay? You are all I think and dream about. Please let me know how many days you could get this done, okay? Apparently didn't pay attention in fifth grade grammar, <laughs> yes. okay? Then here's Kimberly. I am not happy either, cause am broke, babe. Have you looked for another loan company, sweetie? Now, these women don't know each other, but they both say cause, C-O-S. Isn't that odd? Yes, it is odd. Candace. Yes, I understand you, my love, because I have believe in me, honey, okay? I can't run away for you. I am truly love you with all my heart, my love. So, my love, I want you to go and send me the money <laughs> now so that I can get the buyer document before the Walmart would close there, honey. Now, reckon why Candace doesn't know how to spell her name. Is that thought provoking? Any of this thought provoking? Yeah. You know, I've, I've talked to some of these folks that are scammers and we, we've actually talked to them. We've talked to the ambassador from Nigeria. Uh, we've talked to some of the investigators that deal with these from the FBI. And one of the questions I have is, look, any computer has grammar and spell check on it. Why the hell don't you just click and drag this and it'll clean it up for you? You know what they said? They said, we don't clean it up on purpose because the person that's willing to overlook this are the best targets. If we send someone broken English, bad spelling, obvious mistranslations of English and they're willing to look past that, that is a live fish. Okay. We've done these kind of cases before. You've probably seen some of the shows. You watch the Dr. Phil show, I do right? watch it. Thank you. Appreciate that. I love your show. Thank you. I really do appreciate you watching, and I hope that um, you know that I always treat our guests with dignity and respect, and I intend to do you the same way. What I want to do is help you, and I want to enlighten you with some things that we've learned.